Hello everybody. You see this and you want this, right? The snap menu, slide menu, UI menu, whatever you might call this. You want this? Well, this is from my game ball game, of course. It's the real player. I'll be launching my game soon and you can try that. It's something like unique, but not so much unique. And I hope. Let's begin the work. Shall we? Okay. Let's start the new scene. We add the. What do we add? We add panel, of course. We go to canvas, change the settings. Here we are, canvas, change render mode to screen space camera, render camera, go to same, set the main camera, and one more important thing, UI scale mode to scale with screen size, that's perfect. You see this panel? Yeah. You see this panel, you go to transform, click shift alt, the option goes this way. And click this middle stretch right now you'll notice we can there's the value right and height there's no width because the panel will expand itself to cover the whole width of the device now let's change the value of height it's thousand yeah that will be enough now we are going to add the scroll bar right you are uh, scroll bar you can't see no scroll view actually you can't see in the option but there it is scroll view not scroll bar scroll view we added the scroll view we go to inspector and we change it to stretch right now there are two bars for horizontal and vertical we delete vertical one delete delete we delete particle, go to viewport, go to content, go to UI, and then add panel. Mm -hmm. Panel, of course, but before that, before the delete panel again, content, we go to edit inspector. Now, what do we do? We change the viewing area of content, right? Right. We go to scroll view and vertical. Click vertical. Okay, just do that. Mm -hmm. Don't ask me questions. Viewport. Yes, yeah, you see the white line at the bottom. We don't need it. So go to scroll bar horizontal, height to zero it's gone right go to content mm, you see the viewing area of content and we add panel where is the panel where is the panel uh-huh we click shift alt center mm -hmm. center we change the width to 500 now 600 yeah to the panel we will add a image where's the image yes the image mm -hmm. center center of course 500 500 height and width we take it to the top set all top yes go to the top click the panel click the panel go to UI and then button now after we add the button right we added the button where is the button? Here is the button. Where is the button? Where is the button? Right. Here is the button. Mm -hmm. We change height to 50, maybe 60. Yes, width is fine. Go to text. Remember text by we change the font size of course it's not visible increase the size PUI size 49 that's good click the button paste it 
control D. You can do that by control D. Go to text, use. Rename the text as use. The button is use button. Rename it, use. Now drag and drop it down, down, down. Okay, everything's fine. Go to content, add component. Content size filter, that's it. Right? Horizontal fit to preferred size. Better. Now add component. Horizontal layout group. Okay, here we are. That's the horizontal layout group. 200 from left. Not 200. 100. Yes. And 100 from right. What's that? You'll understand later. I will show you. Child element, upper left, upper left, middle left. Uh -huh. Same, no problem. Now, up to here, we are done. What do we do now is we just click the panel. Add what? Add the panel. Where? At the bottom. Right, click Shift Alt. Uh -huh. Click Shift Alt. No, 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 not stress. Click here, click shift alt, take it to the bottom. Now change the height to 50 and width to 60. No 6 plus 0, it's 60. Do you see that? Do you see the panel? Here is the panel. Here is the panel. 60 won't work. So 200. Yes. 200. To this panel, We'll add component. What do we add? It's horizontal content. It's horizontal layout group to the panel. We'll add UI buttons. Where is the button? Where is the button? And to the bottom, we'll give height with 30 by 30. No, 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 no. 50 by 50. Okay. That's it, 50 by 15, but no. 40 by 40, you can make your own values. Now go to this panel. Right. No upper left, middle left. Mm -hmm. And, and, and. Oh, oh, scroll view. Go to scroll view, go to content now. Here comes the main part. The script part. Where is the script? 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 Click content. Okay, in the content, we'll add the script swipe. Here is the swipe script. Where is the yes? Make size to two. Change the colors. What are these colors? You will surely know that. One is red. Another would be white. Yes. Now it says the scroll bar. What is the scroll bar? Here is the scroll bar. It asks for image content. Oh, sorry. You have to rename this panel to image container. Now, where is the content? Here is the content. Here is the script. Swipe the script. It asks for image. We will give you the image. Right? Go to the button. Uh -huh. Provide its function. On click. Now drag the content. No function. We'll give a function. Swipe. And then which button clicked? Oh, the field is empty again. Now just drag the same button. Oh. Drag the same button and throw it here. Done. We are absolutely done. Control D. Oh. Click the button, Control D, Control D. You see the changes here? Yes, that's the changes. We are going to add three buttons now. Scroll view, have we changed it? Yes, scroll view, but you are unchecked. Uh, I think everything is done now. Well, this is this panel is our container. Container of everything. And what do you mean everything? Well, this container contains this image. 
the buy button and the sell button do you want to change its color it's easy go to the color what color do you want green it's green then right now what do we do click the container control d control d you see the changes that's the changes you like don't you now what to do what to do what to do i think everything is done let's play shall we oh look the beautiful angel look it look it it's beautiful oh it's not on the screen but there are three little buttons at the bottom and if you click them by clicking them but that button you can change these panels too so you can click them or you can just swipe them right right that's done oh and swipe script where is the swipe script container contains swipe script you want this swipe script i'll provide in description i may yeah i will show you the code too should i should i should i not well i decided you to show the script this is the swipe script you see this mm -hmm. that's all in there you type it or maybe i'll provide you the link of the script here is the script take your time pause the video and copy paste the script okay that's done let's go to unity mm. now one thing one thing one thing one thing one thing one thing uh, in the content in horizontal layer group you change the value of left and right it's it just says the space from left or right the hundred hundred dollar right look 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 yes this is hundred and what is from right and the space from right is also 100 and 100 if you want 200 it will go more this way if you want 300 it will go more this way so you get it right now the video is complete oh one more thing one more thing one more thing this is image you want to change the change the image make it ball so easily implemented and another image so okay now when you play again look how beautiful it looks buy button use button of course the functions are not added if you want more functionality like 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 wait please like when you click buy button when buy button should be disappeared there will be only use button if you want function like this i can share you the whole script the whole methods whatever you say i made for this game i did everything i can share you you just have to comment there what you need and i'll be providing you with everything that is as you right for this enjoy the snap menu That's it my friends. Thank you. Bye. Please don't forget to subscribe and like the video.